A crushed Iowa DOT vehicle and a smashed Iowa State Patrol car were the backdrop Tuesday. As law enforcement announced, they will be boosting traffic safety enforcement June 9th through the 12th. Law enforcement officers across Iowa are seeing some of the fastest speeds and impaired driving they've seen in their careers. 119 people died on Iowa roads so far this year. That's a 25% increase from last year. Even with fewer people driving during the pandemic, the roads are more dangerous. Excessive speed and impaired driving skyrocketed in 2020. The state patrol says speed and distracted driving contributed to this massive pileup on I-80 on February 4th, where a state trooper nearly lost his life. And last month, Iowa experienced the deadliest May in the last nine years with 41 deaths. 41 mothers, fathers, children, sisters, brothers, neighbors, and friends. No one knows that personal pain more than Gary Frank. A drunk driver hit and killed his son Wade in 2015 while Wade was riding his bike on Grand Avenue. I wake up in the night knowing that Wade Wade's death was entirely preventable. Frank says he supports this new statewide safety initiative. The task force gives us hope that others won't be killed tragically, needlessly, foolishly. And the goal of this initiative is to keep traffic deaths in Iowa below 300 this year. That would be the lowest since 1925.